I started snowboarding about six years ago, and then I saw my girlfriends doing it. And they were riding really fast, and it was impressed me a lot. So I for sure wanted to do it again. Well, I've been skateboarding for about 13 years. I like to skate a lot of vertical pools and ramps, and then besides that, I like to skate a little street and mini ramps, but mostly vertical. Uh, my sponsors are Burton Snowboards, and Volcom, and I met, and uh, Stormy. My pro model for Burton is a 140, and it's similar to the twin that they, they have out, the twin 39, except a different edging for more like pipe riding, and a little stiffer. I think it's a lot of skateboarding that helps me out because I get to do a lot of skateboarding when it's not snowboard season and that keeps my aggression level up. It's like I'm not away from it. So I jump back and forth a lot with skating and snowboarding in my head. I'm always thinking about it. I'm just always on the line. I think women snowboarding has changed a lot in the last six years that I've been in it. I've seen it get better and better every year and I get super stoked on that because it pushes me and that's what I want. I want to ride with people that are doing things that I'm not doing. Girls and guys are raised different, and it's not easy for girls when they hear from their teachers or friends or parents, but that's not for girls to do. And that's embedded in, in girls' brains over the years. And you know, don't get dirty, Sally. Don't hurt yourself. So it's a whole society thing, for sure. There's a lot of girls out there that have potential to be really good. They just need to have something to look up to. They need to have the female riders to see in videos and magazines. The things that I believe in are just to try to be a good person and just respect everyone for who they are and not what they are. It's an Egyptian cat, Bastet, and it's a sun goddess, worshiped for good things, power, strength, the sun, all the things I like.